Hi, Coach Randy here. Hey, in another video, we talked about having a strategic plan for your life, about not just going through it happenstance, but being intentional and strategic. And um, today I want to take that thought just a, a couple steps further. You know, if I want to plan my day, I really should have some idea uh, where I want the end of my life to be. Because I know this isn't something a lot of people give a lot of thought to, but every step that you take takes you closer to whatever destination you are pointed towards. And uh, a lot of times people forfeit, they default, they end up places they don't want to be. Not because they didn't have good intentions or because they didn't care about themselves or about their families, but just because they never really uh, became intentional in terms of strategy. So every step leads towards something. And I don't expect that any person would know with crystal clarity you know where the end of your life is going to end up but I think there are a lot of clues inside of us that can begin to give us some indication of where we want our lives to be ask yourself simple questions like uh, you know if if I found out I only had another year to live what would be important to me what are the kind of things that I want other people to say about me after I'm gone? If time and money weren't an issue and it was impossible for me to fail, what would I do with my life? I think that there are clues inside of you, uh, passions that you have, um, values that you hold. They're not there by accident. They are. I believe they're by design and they're indicators of what the meaning of your life is, what the purpose of it is, if you will. So I believe in order to plan today or this week or this month, I need to begin to give some forethought to what I want the end to look like. I know to some people that's a morbid thought. To me, it's a, it's a beautiful, wonderful thought. Because nothing could be more morbid than finding out that you only had a short time to live and you weren't even pointed in the right direction. Uh, so just a, a little, little seed, I guess, to plant from my heart to yours to begin thinking about what you want the destination to look like. It starts out kind of vague, you know. I could tell you with perfect clarity what I believe I'm walking towards. But I've been developing that vision for over 20 years now. And, you know, at first I got little pieces and they were vague. Over years I began to put the pieces together and it became more and more defined. So it really is a process, what I'm talking about. And every time you get a new piece, you make little adjustments and uh, little corrections. And that helps you to walk your life with greater strategy and, and intentionality. I believe life is not only about knowing what to say yes to, but um, maybe even more so, what to say no to. And the thing that I'm talking about right now will give you the tools to be able to do that. So I wanna encourage you. Uh, I've developed a whole training to help you in this regard. And uh, it's called Becoming a Fearless Leader. And you can download your copy for free at www.becomingafearlessleader.com.